<laughs> Guys, a Porsche, you know? It's a Porsche one. This is, this is a beautiful car. I can stand here and look at this car all day. Very beautiful car. So the guys at ATL called me and asked me if I want to test drive this car. And I'm like, yep, <laughs> for sure. Man, this is a full electric car, guys. All electric Porsche Taycan. It's a Porsche Taycan, but when you look at it, it look like Taycan to me. It look like Taycan. But it's a Porsche Taycan. Same like how in um, other countries or like Germany, there's a Porsche or something like that. Yeah, but I have to show you guys this car. This, yo, guys, this car fast like bullets. Fast, so fast. Man, this is, this is actually, I think this is the lowest spec in this car. This is the forest. This is the forest. This has like 400 like 400 and no sorry 500 and and little something i'll put up the exact number on this on the screen it has like 500 and change horsepower but like when you put it in launch control the horsepower go up to like almost 600 like 590 something or something like that again i'm, I'm not sure about numbers but i'll put it up on the screen and being an electric car you know, I'll, I'll open this side. Boom. No engine in here, so get a little storage space. Let me show you guys. Let me show you. Get a little storage space in here. You can put like a, a little bag. Like if you go, I mean, I don't even really need to put anything in here because around the back, around the back, you have the trunk. Let's open the trunk. Have the trunk some boxes in i wonder if i some gift these i know this is the charger but what i wonder if these are so, like some gifts for me i want them box them i feel like fast now them lock them lock i won't fast guys oh yeah you have the trunk it's a big enough trunk big enough trunk space the car itself my, man, this car is beautiful, you know? It's a Porsche, you know, guys? It's a Porsche. Like I said, it's a lowest spec. If you want bigger wheels, you know you have to pay for that. These are 19 inch wheels. Man. Soul electrified. Yeah, let's let's close this trunk. This Imbo trunk. Bonnet. Windshield washer fluid in here. And brake fluid over there lock this down admire this car a little more look at the lights guys lights them lights pretty you know the front of the car pretty the side of the car pretty the brake guys it's a push it's a push guys and like i said this is the lowest spec and this is this is like 24 million. Well, let me get let me get the let me get the figures. So I don't lie. Does they send me the figures? Let me tell you. Open this now and tell you guys the exact. I'm fine, but the message. There you go. All right. So this is the 4s. 158,000 US dollars. That's around 24 million Jamaican. Then you have the Taycan Turbo, which is 196,000 US dollars. Then the Taycan Turbo S, 220, pretty much 230,000 US dollars. Taycan Turbo GT, 252,000 US dollars. So, yeah, look on 30, 36 million Jamaican, 30 something, 33, 36 roughly from 24 
million to like 36, 38 million Jamaican. I'm not sure. And then you have the, yeah, and then you can get the wise, wise sack package. I guess it have like some different seats and fast. <laughs> Guys, this car fast like, like I said, fast like bullet and the response. I'm gonna drive it later, and you know, give you guys my my reaction. I mean, I, I already reacted to it from a pick it up, but I need to give you guys an actual react. The car fast and the instant torque, like it's not the fastest car, but it's fast, quick. Like the instant torque from the electric motor, like the minute you touch the gas, you can get the full power in like 10 meters that ridiculous that ridiculous man guys let's take a look inside the car it doesn't pop up by itself i don't think so you have to like put your i guess you put your hand on it and it pop out let me try that again let me close it back let me see no, you have to kind of touch it. Put your hand under it. But if you want it to come out, look at you can just press home, unlock on the keys, and it come out. Let's, before we go inside the car, let's look at the charging. The charging. Yeah, you come here, boom, touch it, just like a regular gas tank. You don't meet. I think you can get like the automatic one where there's a little button here, you touch it and it slides inside. So yeah, that's where you charge, that's where you fill it up. <laughs> that's where you fill up the tank. <laughs> Beautiful red interior. Wow. The AC turned on already and I just touched the door outside. The AC on, chair on pretty much. So this screen, is for the climate control and you can control the music from here as well let's let's press the start button switch it on there you go uh, two screens one over here one here and look at this guys the climate control i press it you can control how the ear move oh let me turn on the music there so you can control which direction the ear moves. So you don't touch the vent, you don't move, the vent can't move, it's stationary. So you control it on the screen. You can move, you want the ear blow up, or you want it blow down, wherever you want it blow, or you want it blow straight. Same thing over this side. The passenger can also control the screen, you can control the navigation, and it doesn't affect the screen. You can see that? The music. Over this with the man. Full glass roof, panoramic roof. And it it doesn't like it just always open guys. There's no shade. It just get a tinted roof. And then um the address. Oh, you close it again, you have to pull it out. I think you have to pull it out with both hands. I'll demonstrate that when whenever I can. Man. Okay, nice enough guys, cup holders, nice steering wheel, the steering wheel doesn't move until you put it in drive and how you put it in drive, this little knob right here, press it down, you're in drive, yeah I know the door open, so when I put it in drive, the steering is free up, put it back in park, steering stiff up back again, so the steering, so that means the steering is not connected to the wheels. It's like a remote control, in a sense. Yeah, it's a, yeah, not in a sense, it's a remote control. Let me close the door. So I don't get too much noise. Man, so, yeah guys, let's, you have the drive modes, you can change the, change from sport, from normal. So you have normal, sport, sport plus, and you have individual. I guess you, set, you can set it up whichever way you want. But sport, when you put it in sport, it has air suspension, so the car lowers. And guys, 
you feel the difference. Like a normal car does drive like a luxury vehicle. And then when you put it in sports, you feel the steering get stiff or the car get a little stiff. When you put it in sport plus, it feel like a go-kart. It's the first electric vehicle I, I, I've driven and it doesn't feel heavy. It doesn't feel like an electric vehicle. The car, it feel like a go-kart. It feels like a go-kart. You have a little storage area here. And like I say, put it in park right here, up for reverse, down for drive, park again. Man, guys, I'm loving this car, believe me. When I came home, I sent a message and I'm like, yo, how much for this car? And they said, 24 million for this spec that I have. And I'm like, ooh, when I beg, when I beg it, I car and I beg it free. <laughs> but so they give me it free. Guys, believe me, you won't understand this car until you drive, unless you drive it. You won't understand. And I, if you drive this car, you won't cost electric vehicle again. Because I know a lot of you guys are like big on engines and the sound. Me too. <laughs> you know, I'm big on how the car sound and the engine. And can I tell you guys, I drive this car and it's like it have a, a sound inside you can turn it off and turn it on it sound like sound kind of sound like a spaceship sound woo, it sound wicked though it sound wicked when you're driving the car it sound wicked it sound tough when you drive this car you won't care about no engine because the way it feel the way it drive that was my issues issue with the electric vehicle like they always feel too big and heavy and like you actually feel the weight of the car and you're, you're sitting in the car you feel like the weight is on actually on you <laughs> you know but this it feel like a go-kart it feel i don't know what porsche did it but it's porsche 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 a porsche <laughs> porsche porsche in right now with this car it's wicked man wicked wicked i can't i can't ever i can't explain to you guys oh how much you know i love this car i love it and if i ever see a little you know money rise up somewhere i'm definitely going to buy this car my wife love it as well she was like wow how much for this <laughs> she love it i'm gonna let her drive it but trust me it feels like a rocket ship man i can't expect that you guys if you get a chance to test drive it go ahead and test drive it because i make sure you turn on the little sound oh you do that you see a little car here and a little car here you can do it wherever you just press it and it's it come up electric sound off or on let's keep that on electric sound and you woo. i'm gonna when i go for the drive i'm gonna let you guys hear it but yeah guys that's how you that's how you do that and you can change up you can change up a lot of things on it you can chassis everything medium or whatever hard you can change up a lot you can do a lot guys i guess this you see this with the wheels guys yeah i would i would rather have the it have there's a this black wheels i would rather to have on this car Obviously, I'm going to put up a video of it or a picture of how it look. I have a little pocket on here. When I say little, I mean little. Little pocket. But in a sports car, once you have cup holder, you don't need nothing else. You have another little storage here and there, but I don't know what I can store because it don't really have a, a lip to stop anything. It's just a open area. Oh, the, you have the charging stuff in here too, you know some usb cigarette uh, the cigarette lighter thing let's go in the back seat and see um you see the back of the seat you know my kids have has been in here and i always cost them to stop putting them foot on the car seats you know i'm that parent i look around the back and i hey boy take your foot off of my seat <laughs> but kind of look tight around here i don't even know if i want to try and attempt let me try though <laughs> all right I'm um, in the car. Um, I mean, it's it's not bad. It's it's all right. It's let's pick up this Porsche book. It's all right. Um, this this seat is where I would put it if I was sitting in the front passenger seat. So 
I could sit behind myself. That's one, right? Yeah, I could sit behind myself. Yeah, man. Headroom, nice. The, the the roof, the mo yo. I can't. I don't know if the sun or the, it must have a, like a UV thing inside of it to protect you from the sun. Because, the, like I said, the roof, the roof is just a, a glass, just a full glass roof, no shade. I guess the tint is the shade. Oh, yeah man, I like it, you have your own um, AC vent around here. And, uh, there's a two-seater around the back, pretty much two seats. So you can just, while you're sitting around here, you can just drop out this, put your hand on it and just go on cruise. Cause nobody can, no, <laughs> oh, nobody can sit on here though. For what? Maybe one of the kids have a seatbelt, you know? <laughs> have a seatbelt. <laughs> go, go small, you have to be to sit on here. One of the kids can sit here. It's a two-seater. Just leave it at that. It's a sports car and it's a two-seater. No three people not supposed to pack up in the back of this. No adult. No adults shouldn't pack up in the back of this. Two is fine. Yeah, man. Let's get out of this. All right, guys. Let's go for a drive. I don't know what mode it's in right now. Well, oh, you both don't know. It's in normal mode right now. And um, I'm going to keep it in normal, normal mode until I get out the gate. Because I don't know. Oh low this car gets when you put it in sports. You hear that? You hear that? That beep that means the, the nose is close to the ground. Alright, let's put it in sports plus. Sport plus. Oh, you hear that? You hear the sound, guys? I don't know if you're hearing the sound, you know. Yeah, man. You hear it? <laughs> Yo, no sir, guys, the way this car fast. <laughs> no sir, guys, this guy is a real eternal, you know. <laughs> no sir, guys, this car has no business being so fast. No business, and it's the pickup, you know. Just touch it, it gone. Touch it, it gone. Alright, let's get out. We don't have an autobahn. So I won't go too far. Alright. Let's go. I'm going to look at test track out here. On the main road. Ready? Go! <laughs> not. Guys, this guy make a smile every time. Turn on this road. This car make a smile every time and everybody stare at it when you pass. Man. No sir. Man. We don't have no roads in Kingston to go in at high speed. I don't I don't want to go in at high speed because the way this make my head hurt me. My head hurt me. All right, ready? Go. Block shot. No, sir. And guys, it car feel like a go kart. It it not bumpy, not jumping all over the place. It just feel like a go kart, and that that's a little rough here right there, you know. It's a little rough here right there. Man, this car is nice, man. I can't see myself driving this every day. I have um, 86% battery. I got it at 96% yesterday. And uh, I was in some traffic, drove, drove home. Was in traffic for like an hour and um, got home. Then me and wife we went to a function at Ardy last night and went for dinner, then went home. Alright. 
let's go up here. All right, guys, watch it. Every every time you every time you ask for it, guys, it it answer. I feel like a go kart. Like a go kart, man. No, sir. Not, not going too far. Not going too far. All right, guys. Let's try a launch. All right, just to launch it, you just press the, just press the brake and the accelerator. Let me not say gas pedal, accelerator. Alright, so let us stop, brake, accelerator, launch control activated. Wee! <laughs> Yo! Yo! The car make me say wee! Wee! I have to go blur out, blur out the speed because I know I wasn't speeding. Man, by the time I don't press this, no battery leave in it you know, to take back <laughs> when I'm taking it back to Porsche. I won't have any battery, but this car feel like it would be a wicked track car though. Going back home now, put it back in normal, in normal mode. Uh, I just feel, just feel comfortable. In normal mode, it feels super comfortable. Man, this car make you feel confident. All right, guys, that's gonna be it. I hope you guys enjoy this test drive with me. This car is a very lovely car, and guys, trust me, trust me. It's not like nobody pay me, even pay me to 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 say these things. I wish, I wish they would pay me to say these things, but uh, but honestly speaking. This is the best car I've driven in my entire life. Best car I've driven in my life. The car, and you know, it has a lot to do with technology. You know, technology will make the cars feel a lot better, drive a lot better, and it's a Porsche. It's a Porsche, guys. <laughs> so like up the video, guys, and subscribe to the channel, and go and test drive a Porsche if you can. If you can get a test drive a Porsche, I even sit in one. I recommend. Highly recommend.